Hey, what's going on everyone? Today I'm taking a look at this cool 3D printer. This is the Lulzbot Mini. And this thing is pure awesomeness. It can do some amazing prints and some very detailed prints as well. And this one is not just for professionals, it's for everyone. If uh, you're not a professional modeler, you can just go to websites like Thingiverse and you can download many models uh, like this and just drag and drop into the software and hit print. The great thing about this one, there's no need to calibrate or do anything. It does everything automatically. You just put the file, click print, and it's done. Uh, 3D printing nowadays is not just for a professional, for pre-production products. You can print anything that's useful, uh, like toys, anything like that, or print useful products like this. Uh, this is a toilet paper holder here. Or print out figures that look amazing, you can place anywhere. The interesting thing about this printer is most of the parts, like the gears, the sides here, the front, most of it is printed with other 3D printers like this. So let's say you notice over time something is uh, tending like to loosen up or trying to break. You can just like go ahead and print it off, then uh, just do the replacement yourself. It's that easy. And everything is included on the USB that's included with the whole package. If you haven't done so already, go ahead and click the subscribe button to stay up to date for upcoming tech reviews. When we're looking at the level of detail this printer is able to produce, it still amazes me that I can do this at my own home. Just uh, drag and drop and hit that print button. And if we look at the lines here, everything is detailed. Uh, everything looks uh, the way I saw it on the 3D model. And uh, when I hit it print, uh, this is what I got. And everything is uh, very smooth as well too. Everything, the corners, it's uh, just the way it's supposed to be. So when we're taking a look at the calibration uh, process, pretty much it does it automatically. As soon as you hit print, it will go around and touch all the metal pieces that are on the four sides. And uh, that's pretty much it. Then it also cleans the nozzle before it starts doing that as well. Then it just waits for the whole thing to heat up and it starts uh, printing. Then you're also able to do some uh, useful 3D prints as well. Like uh, we see here, this uh, controller holder. Uh, this, I don't think you can even, even buy this and it looks so cool and you can customize this. You can even like if uh, you were gonna 3D model a little, little bit, you can even put your name on it or your logo, anything you want it. And it fits perfectly as we see here. It's so nice. Taking a closer look, uh, we have a heated bed, also double fans there. So you won't have any warped uh, prints or anything like that. Works out very well. And all the cable management is very nice and clean. Everything is done perfectly. Nothing really shows, no cables show. It just looks very smooth. So when we're looking at the Cura software that's included in the USB, it's uh, very easy and straightforward. I'm not gonna go into much details in this because uh, there's nothing to it. So the first thing we see here, beginner, first run. So even if you leave it at beginner, you're okay with it. Uh, standard, high speed and high quality. So as you see up here, the times change as well. So to print these two at the high detail is gonna take an hour and 20 minutes, or if you want them high speed, 44 minutes. <laughs> So what sets this uh, Lulzbot Mini apart from other 3D printers? Uh, it's like the calibration, the self-calibration, it does everything automatically. The cleaning, the nozzle cleaning done here. And it just does everything perfectly by itself. Uh, you don't really need to do anything else except hit that print button. Uh, this is definitely not my first or last uh, review of this printer. I'm gonna definitely be doing some more prints. I'm gonna make more videos. Please go ahead and click that subscribe button now to stay up to date for more upcoming reviews and uh, go ahead and click that like button as well if you enjoyed this video. See you guys next time.